Hi everyone. I hope you're having a good day today and welcome back to new video. Do you have a problem with your apps like revoked, cannot open or always force close? If you do on this video, I will show you how to fix that with Maple Designer, fix revoked apps and alternative sideload EU on iOS. On this video, we will try another sideload, Maple Signer how to work and why you must use this best alternative sideload. By open your browser like Safari browser, go to Maple Signer website to download and install the sideload tools. Let's click to join this Maple Signer Discord server. By this Discord server, you can install directly this Maple Signer apps on your devices just by click that link seamlessly like this video. Look at your home screen menu, see the installation's progress, and wait until finished. Many sideload apps like Scarlet or etc. has been banned with Apple. Now you can try Maple Signer. You can sign EPA with Maple Signer by open this Maple Signer apps, then click top of the right corner icon to select and target your IPA file what you want to install. Then select IPA file want to install. For examples, on this video, I will target the Misaka IPA files I have to make Misaka apps intels with this Maple Signer sideload. After you selected the files, wait the signing process. Then click tap to install at the bottom mid icon. Then click install. Look, the installation's progress, it's working right. It's successfully installed, right? Successfully install IPA with Maple Signer. Then click the icon of IPA files you installed to try it. It's running right. The Maple Signer has helpfully. The Misaka apps I installed has normally running, and I can use this apps without revoke. So easy, right? With Maple Signer, just by open, target the IPA files what you want, wait the signing, and done. You can use the IPA files what you want to install without revoke. And normally running. You have to purchase Maple Signer first. It's low price, and you can get best price with this Maple Signer because this side load has helpfully, I think. You must buy this Maple Signer because I really recommended you to buy and use this tools if you needed it. After payment complete, then make a ticket. Get your UD ID, then you can use Maple Signer normally, like I used this Maple Signer before. So, thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe this channel, and see you next to another video.